Hello and welcome to this tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how to verify your Leap device using all the tools inside your Active 550 box. You ought to be able to calculate your overall uncertainty. First thing first, set your device up. Take your test block out of the box and make sure the surface of your test block is fully cleaned. From the wizard, choose verification. You'll notice that your impact device is automatically detected. We need to add the test block into Equitip 550 database first. On the test block management screen, add your test block. You have to input the information such as your serial number and obviously the hardness value of your block. You find all this information on your test block certificate. I'm going to add the hardness value of my block. In this case is 771 lead. The uncertainty of my test block is 4.7. I'm going to add that in as well. You can add the calibration date as well. This is again on your test block certificate. If you prefer, you can also add a little comment. Now you can see the test block is added into the Equative 550 database. Next thing, you can define what standard you want to comply to. In my case, I want to calculate the overall uncertainty of my system and comply to the ISO standard for LEAP. There are other parameters that you may need to define as well. Place your impact device in your test block and perform number of impacts. In this case we're going to do 10 and by doing so we'll be able to calculate the overall uncertainty of our system as well. When the testing is done you'll notice the device says the verification is passed. This data is now stored inside the device. You can access the verification data and review them when needs be. Thank you for watching this video and we hope you find it useful.